Hello, my name is Bob Craven. I'd like to talk to you about a J40 called White Light. It is a spectacular boat that has had a major amount of revision done to it. It looks like a tremendously brand new boat from the outside and it sails like a dream. A slow panorama of the interior starts with the navigation station to starboard, the L-shaped galley to port, with a deep double sink and propane stove. Looking forward, you come to the uh, interior salon with a large uh, seating area around the drop-down table. The table is um, currently up against the wall, but can fold down and out to full size. Looking past the forward berth, to a large and comfortable settee on the starboard side again. Looking into the bow, one can see an ample V berth forward uh, with both hanging locker and drawers and an in suite head in the forward part of the boat. All the lighting in the boat has been changed to LEDs. The galley has a very nice three burner propane stove, Tasco, a very deep um, Adler Barber refrigeration system with a cold spot on one half and a double deep sink with brand new faucets. Just aft of the galley is the aft head, very similar to the forward head with lots of space and overhead ventilation and light. Um, easy to uh, keep it clean and dry. Looking at the, towards the navigation, you can see the aft cabin area, a large double berth stretching out under the cockpit with, again, a nice suite of drawers and hanging locker within the suite. Below the nav station is where the new batteries have been installed, controlled by a Magnum Select power control center. Additional electronics in the area are standard VHF and a Furno GPS system as a backup. At the helm station, we have brand new Raymarine electronics, including a chart plotter, wind indicator and multi-indicator and a autopilot with a RAM autopilot below decks. All of these instruments can be seen below on a tablet connected to the electronics. All of the new navigational electronics have been mounted on a custom-built stainless steel mast at the stern. The ample cockpit is protected from the elements by a collapsible dodger which is in excellent condition. Recently serviced winches include two very powerful primaries that are electrically powered, both for low and high speed work. The switches for these winches are at the base of the helm station, two for each side. A large wheel and adjacent traveler allow for easy shorthanded sailing. Derayed vents in front of the dodger and next to the mast allow for comfort below decks even while sailing in tough conditions. The double spreader mast and Selden furler on the fore deck give you great control under many different sailing conditions as well. All in all, White Light shows great pride of ownership, a underbody that allows for tremendous sailing, a beautiful new paint job, and it's ready to go cruising at a moment's notice.